Good morning, everyone, and welcome to SNN. Today is Thursday, December 1st, 2016. Yay! December is my favorite month, except for my birthday month, of course. It is a hawk day, which means star periods 2, 4, and 6. It has been 34 years since Michael Jackson's history-making thriller was released on this day in 1982. And it's still the best-selling album of all time. It spent nearly two and a half years on the Billboard charts with 37 weeks in the number one spot. In addition to being created with breaking down racial barriers and transforming music videos, Thriller is one of those rare musical hits when almost every song could be a lead single. Staying with this musical theme on SNN, we're kicking off our annual Well, we did it last year. 12 days of Name That Tune. We play a song. You listen and see if you can Name, name that, that tune. tune. Then call 78293. Ready to listen? Call 78293 when you can Name That Tune. Go. Go. There's a pie. And there's fried pie. Today is National Fried Pie Day. Here are today's five things to know about fried pie. Fried pies are small fried dessert pastries which have fruit fillings wrapped in the dough. Fried pies are, were the first introduced in, wait for it, McDonald's in 1968. Originally fried <coughs> in lard. New Hampshire's fried pies. Blueberry or blackberry were flavored the, variation. Were the first, were the favorite dessert of the U.S. President <laughs> Franklin Pierce. The two most popular flavors <coughs> of fried pies in the Deep South are apple and peach. Roadside stands in the South often refer, refer to them as crab lanterns, which... Well, we don't know what to say about that. While we're on the topic of food, this week is all about the food drive. That's right. Stuff the bus is tomorrow. Our community is counting on us. Donate what you can canned fruits and vegetables, mac and cheese, juices of any flavor, e I, either the one half gallon, a half gallon or juice packs, soups and saltine crackers, peanut butter and jelly, pancake mix and syrup, canned tuna or chicken, instant potatoes or stuffing mix, chili, beans and baked beans, cereal hot or cold, sugar, flour or vegetable oil, pasta and pasta sauce, all these items are needed. A little can go a long way. Our generosity gives <coughs> others hope. Th this is one little thing that you can do to help someone in need. Whatever you can bring is appreciated, but please bring something. Now here's Mr. Altmiller with some details. Okay. Good morning, Skyhawks. So I have been down and seen all the canned food that's been brought in thus far, and you guys are doing awesome. Keep it up. Uh, I want to give you kind of update on Stuff the Bus tomorrow. Um, it's going to be, the bus should be here around 10.35. Um, it's up to your teachers if they want to take you out to, to the bus or not. It's a great time. The high school band will be here playing and pepping everybody up. And it's, it's really awesome. The goal is to stuff the bus, of course. Um, but a food drive does not end tomorrow. It goes through next week. So I have some numbers here, and I'm going to read them off and let you know where we're at. So for sixth grade, um, the class that's in third place is Mr. Baumgarten's homeroom class. In second place is Mrs. Amundsen's class. And in first place... Mrs. Becker. Ooh. So that's sixth grade, seventh graders. In third place, Mr. Constein. In second place is Mrs. Roberts and Mrs. Roy's class. And in first place is Mrs. Kim Cooper. Uh, for eighth grade, third place, Mrs. Olson's class. Second place, Mrs. Manjex. And in first place, and the overall school leader right now. So right now, this class, if they hold it up, they're going to win the pizza party. At the end of it is Mrs. Leonard's class. Ooh. So keep bringing those contributions. Um, let's make a big push for tomorrow because half of everything goes on to Stuff the Bus tomorrow and then the other half will be sent out next week with um, the Carol Project. <coughs> um, also remember, remember it's a, pri a pizza price for the winning class overall. And then keep track of your personal donations as you come in because the top winners for those will get to pie a teacher or an administrator in the face um, at our assembly right before uh, we leave for holiday break. Which is the 16th. Thank you. Okay, um, so keep that rolling in and keep up the, the uh, pressure of their teachers and uh, get those kids moving along. So thank you very much for your contribution. So let's round this off with the Smensel drawing. So for sixth grade, I have 
the Averys, Avery Perry and Avery Hieronymus. Um, and for seventh grade, we have Luke Martinez and Hunter G. And then for eighth grade, I have Tate Fielding and Tomer <coughs> Dayton. So come on down to the office, get your sminsel, and keep up those donations. You guys are doing awesome. Thank you so much for all your hard work. Thanks, Mr. Altmiller. What a wonderful world it would be if people were a little more caring, a little more kind, and a little more compassionate. Hey, here's what you can do to make the world a better place. The Random Acts of can Kindness meeting. That's today, right? Exactly what I was thinking. Let's go together. Yes, let's. Take a step in the direction of room 121. And start making the world a better place. One random act of kindness at a time. That's today during the last 15 minutes of each lunch. On to sports news. 7th and 8th grade Skyhawk girls, are you interested in trying out for one of our school basketball teams? If so, take the time to sign up in the main office during lunch, before school, or after school. ASB News, calling all 6th graders who are interested in applying for ASB. ASB stands for Associated <coughs> Student Body. They meet in flex and plan activities that improve our school and community. For example, they plan assemblies, handle food drives, dances, mentor program, and other fun activities and events. It's a lot of hard work. They are looking for four to six individuals who are motivated, confident, strong, independent, and work well with others. You have to have a 3.0 grade point average or above. And you have to turn in two teacher evaluations to be considered. The applications are in the main office. You have until December 7th, next Wednesday, to turn it in. Today, 8th grade volleyball at Covington. 7th is home against Covington. Also today, the new book club, The Book Buzz, will meet at 6th grade lunch. And tomorrow is the end of the grading period. And there's also wrestling at Covington. Hey wrestlers, we heard that you did great at your meet on Tuesday. But we didn't get the official news about your two-point win over the opposition, <coughs> Mr. Constein. Saturday, the first LEGO League competition is here at Sky Ridge. And you can go shopping at the Holly Days Bazaar at Liberty from 9 a.m. to 3 p.m. The Carol Food Drive continues through December 12th. 1212. More about the 12th choir concert at CHS. Band concert on the 15th also at CHS. Then there's the ASB Winter Assembly on the last Friday of the school year, the 16th. But tomorrow there's more musical happenings with the Camus Hometown Holiday Tree Lighting. Skyridge Jazz Band is playing and 6th grade choir will be performing at the ho Hometown Holidays in the Birch, tent, Birch Street Tent at 8.40. Go enjoy the winter festivities. Saturday is a big day for Camus football. Wear your papermaker red. Tacoma Dome, Tacoma, Washington. Kickoff is at 7.30 p.m. Game will be televised at 7.30 <coughs> p.m. on Route Sports Northwest. How did our first name that tune go? It was Herman Apple and Let It Snow. It's jazz. It's French. From Quebec. It's percussion at its best. Good job to Bella from Mrs. Smith's class. A treat and fake cash will be delivered to you after our broadcast. That is the news for Sky Ridge Middle School. Where you can believe in yourself. Be you. Today's thought. Enjoy the little things. For one day you may look back. And realize that they were big things. Have a giving Thursday, Skyhawks. Bring your food donations. For stuff the bus tomorrow. Remember to follow the code. The Sky Code. Be safe. Be respectful. Be responsible. And be kind. This has been Natalie. And Meg. At this time, please stand for the pledge. Ready, begin. begin.